Dove of the Desert, San Javier Mission, a beautiful oasis in the Sonoran Desert. The mission is a National Historic Landmark and is one of the top tourist destinations in Southern Arizona. I'm glad that it brings people to Tucson. Sure. With, uh, and certainly when Tucson has big events, well, they come out to the mission. Visitors are sometimes surprised to learn that after more than 220 years, San Javier remains an active Catholic church. Primarily a parish for the Othan people because we're on the uh, San Javier reservation. San Javier's history actually predates the current mission by more than a century. Jesuit missionary Father Kino had established a chain of missions from Sonora, Mexico into what would become Arizona. In 1692, Father Kino began San Javier Mission. Early, more modest churches were built in the area, but in 1783, the church borrowed money from a local rancher and began construction on the current church. Finally, they, they stopped building because they ran out of money. That's why, to this day, San Javier's East Tower has never been finished. During my visit with Father Stephen in the sacristy, the room just off the altar, he shows me something visitors don't get to see on the back of the original doors. And it has uh, inscribed in it one of the builders, uh, Pedro Barajas and uh, the year 1797 when the building was com completed. The door and the mission have survived through an earthquake in 1887 and a lightning strike in 1939. On my tour with Father Stephen, he points out many of the wonderful original statues and murals. They were all clean during major restoration, but the work is never done. When the church is open, the doors are, are open. open. Yeah. And the wind the blows desert, so. and the, <laughs> comes from the south. And yeah. All the dirt comes in. Mm -hmm. And the work being preserved is irreplaceable. A lot of time people helped in the building of the church and decorating. And, uh, these here, thumbprints. Thumbprints. That's how they painted that. Yeah, hey, let's prints. decorate. Hey, I know what, I got a good idea. Let's do that. Father Stephen points out hidden things to look for on your next visit. There's a, a snail. Yep. That black Uh huh. I see snail. that. Go up a little further over there is a rabbit. Oh, yeah. You see the rabbit? Uh huh. Behind the altar are the ornate statues and even more unique things to look for, including the statue of God at the very top. He doesn't have a long white beard and long white hair. He's red headed. Uh huh. So uh, it's some red headed Spaniard that worked on that piece of it. Another round of restoration is also happening on the outside. The money comes from the nonprofit Patronato San Javier which raised more than $10 million for restorations. Also outside, another unique thing to look for. Now every time I've come back, I always make sure I look and you see the, the cat and the mouse. And the oh, significance yeah. of that is? Well, again, that if the cat catches the mouse, then it's either the end of the building or it's the end of the world. So don't ever catch that mouse. Yeah, yeah, really. Uh, San Javier Mission is obviously uh, a, a big fixture here in southern Arizona and as we say in our series San Javier is certainly absolutely Arizona and thank you very much well, for the tour. Thanks for I coming. I appreciate it. And uh, everyone's welcome to come and pray and uh, just uh, find some peace out here. Thank you Father.